you're going to want to power off the system. Remove. Once the system's off, you're going to want to remove the USB drive and pull the power plug out. Just for a quick second and then power it on. And there you are in Freestyle Dash automatically. Uh, I'm not going to really show you how to configure Freestyle. Um, one thing I will show you what to do is you go to uh, Utilities Settings, System Settings, Fan Settings, and you can turn your Xbox fans all the way up. Basically a 12 volt fan mod, but software based, so you don't have to solder anything. Um, I usually leave it at 60-65%, which is pretty good. Um, you're going to want to set up overscan depending on your TV. Um, date and time is controlled by the NXE dash. Um, speaking of NXE, if you want to get back into NXE, men, uh, NXE Dash, what you're going to do is just turn the system off and then turn it back on and hold the uh, right uh, button there. and it'll go back into NXE for you. Uh, if you don't want to turn the system off and you're in freestyle, you can just hit the uh, center controller button and then go to system settings and it'll take you uh, back to NXE uh, without shutting the system down. Uh, I hope this tutorial helped you. Uh, if you have any comments or questions, just ask. I'll do my best to help. Um, thanks for watching.